and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Angela and I am a fourth year business student at McGill University. Today it is Friday and I do have a little bit of a busier schedule. I have a bunch of Zoom calls that I need to do this afternoon. I have two workshops that I need to do for my club HKSN and then in between those I have another team meeting for my Managing in Asia class to discuss our team project that we need to start working on. And then this evening I made a reservation for Ghana Bar, which if you've seen my vlogs from last semester you'll know that we go there all the time it is our favorite bar Montreal finally opened indoor dining after the lockdown now that indoor dining is back open I can finally go hit up restaurants and cafes like I did last semester so I'm super excited for that but yeah that's my plan for today I don't have anything until my first workshop at 2 p.m. so I'm gonna go make myself a little bit of food right now <music> my first workshop for SMU, which is the Student Society at McGill. It was pretty short. It was just going over some good sustainability practices and how to make our events as a club more eco-friendly and environmentally conscious. Anyways, because it ended pretty early, I'm going to take the next half an hour before my team meeting to catch up on my psychology readings. I actually have a midterm for my psychology class on Wednesday, which is really, really soon. So I will probably be spending a lot of this weekend trying to prep for that. It is my first midterm this semester, but yeah, I'm just gonna go do my reading now and then I will hop on my team meeting at 3 p.m. <music> It's time to head over to Ganadara, so I am going to put on some very appropriate earrings. These are my little soju bottle earrings that I got from some random little Japanese store, I think. It has been so freaking long since I've been to Ghana with my friends. We literally haven't been since last semester, and we used to go all the freaking time. It's our favorite spot in Montreal. We're gonna have dinner, which I don't think I've actually ever done. Whenever we go drinking, we'll like get food on the side but it's never like a dinner <laughs> if that makes sense i'm gonna head out now and meet up with my friends and then walk over together <laughs> It is Saturday now and yesterday was so much fun. We went to Ghana bar and had an amazing dinner there. I was honestly so surprised by how good their food is. And we also got some drinks with that. We got a pitcher of their Pichachu cocktail, which is delicious, as well as a bottle of their calamansi soju, which is also really, really good. And then we picked up some groceries at Marche Nuan on the way. Then we just chilled at our place here and just talked for a few hours. So that was a lot of fun. This morning I have two meetings. I have one for my brand management class and then one for my club HKSN. Just finished my meeting with HKSN. It went really well, but now I need to go meet up with my friends Megan and Lisa. I'm just gonna change my earrings and then I will head out. We are going to this Greek yogurt restaurant. I'm also gonna bring my laptop and stuff because apparently it's a cute little study spot. So we're also going to try to get some work done there. But yeah, I'm so excited. I haven't studied at a cafe in so long, like this whole semester. Everything's obviously been closed. So now that everything is open again, I am very, very excited to go back to my cafe hopping adventures. I think I'm gonna make a video sometime soon about the cafe scene in Montreal and what my favorite cafes are so stick around for that. But I'm gonna go meet up with my friends now, so let's head over.
I just got home after studying at the cafe for like five and a half hours. I met up with Megan at like 12.30 and we head out to the restaurant that we wanted to study at called Yaorti, but when we got there, we found out that they had been closed, like permanently closed. So we ended up going across the street to the Columbus Cafe and Co, which I've actually been meaning to try out for a while now. So I'm really glad that we went there. It's very, very cute and perfect for, sorry. They're currently shoveling the snow on my street and there's like tow trucks towing cars and it's super loud outside oh my gosh i'm just gonna talk over it anyways the cafe was super cute it was a really nice cafe perfect for studying it had great study vibes i just got a drink i got the latte de l'ours which is like their specialty latte it was actually really really delicious i also got the matcha and raspberry muffin which was really good but also super expensive like i literally got a medium drink and a muffin and it cost me 11 dollars, which is definitely a pricey cafe but the vibes were really great we got to study there for literally five and a half hours and i got all of my readings done for my second psychology class which I am super pumped about because now I can start making my midterm review sheet. Right now I am going to go make myself some food because I am hungry. I've only had like an orange and a muffin all day so I'm gonna go make myself some dinner and then probably chill on the couch for a little bit. It is Sunday and today I don't really have any plans during the day but in the evening my friend Kelly is having a little housewarming party at her new apartment so we're gonna be doing like a little charcuterie night during the day I think I'm just going to be studying for my midterm because that is coming up really soon and I still need to go through all of my notes and try to cram that into my brain so that's what I'm gonna be doing today Alrighty, it is 5 p.m. so I am going to head out now to go to the grocery store and then to my friend Kelly's place. I'm going to grab all the stuff that I need to bring over and pick up a few things from the grocery store as well. No, this yeah, this that's one's blue. a goat cheese. Oh, that's it's, goat. It doesn't that's look very cheese. mild, but it's mild. Mm. This is a truffle gouda. Ooh, oh, truffle gouda. Invited, and the rest are a surprise. Come Take us through our cheeses on this board number two. All right, so this is just your standard the seven year old aged cheddar. This is something pretty cool. It's called Chateau de Bourguignon. It's a triple cream. It's very melty. It'll taste like butter. It's mm. great. And this one is a Saint Aveur. Mm. It's my only blue that I like. It's great, salty and creamy. And then over here we have Natasha's beautiful creation. Tell us what this is. It's base free, double cream with mm. sun dried tomatoes on top and garlic between the slices <laughs> and also a lot of thyme. Monday now and yesterday was so much fun. We went over to my friend Kelly's place and did our little charcuterie night, which was delicious. We had two giant boards of charcuterie and we basically finished it all. It was 
amazing. Afterwards, we just played some games and talked and chatted for a while. So I got home pretty late last night. I only have one class today, which is at 2.30 to 4. It's my psychology class, which is a class that I have a midterm for on Wednesday. So I need to study for that midterm today. That's probably all I'm gonna do today and tomorrow because I am not even close to getting through my notes. So I'm gonna try to work on that all day today. I'll probably go to my class in person just in case he says anything important about the midterm before I get studying, I need to have some lunch, so I'm gonna go make myself some food. So I'm around halfway through my notes. I've currently condensed around 17 pages of my original notes into around 7 pages, which is not too bad, but I now need to go head out to my class. I am back home after my psych class. I just made myself a little bowl of popcorn here, so I'm gonna snack on this while I study. It's now 6 p.m. I'm gonna go make myself some dinner, eat it, and then get back to studying because I am not even close to ready for this midterm, but I did finish watching the last interview that I need for this midterm and the last reading that I need to do for today. So now it is just going to be me condensing all of my notes and then after I will go through my notes and try to memorize them. Tuesday aka my busiest day. I'm going to be in classes all day but last night I was able to get some more of my notes done. Even going through it now like a lot of the stuff that I learned because I do find it so interesting has stayed in my brain. It's not too difficult to memorize. Anyways I'm going to continue doing that after I eat some lunch. time for my first class of the day which is my brand management class so I am going to grab my stuff and then head over to Bronfman. I just got home after my very long day of classes and now I am going to spend the next few hours just cramming all of these notes into my brain. Good morning, it is a Wednesday. Today I have my midterm during class at 2.30 to 4, so I am going to review my notes one more time, I think, before class and just take this time to study. And then after class today, I actually made plans with my friend Lois to go to the ceramics cafe, which I'm really excited for. That's where I made my mug here. You can paint it and then they fire it for you. So I'm gonna make another something. I don't know if it's gonna be a mug or whatever yet. I'm gonna be going at 5 p.m. because that's when they have the student discount. For now, I'm just gonna go make myself a little bit of food in the kitchen. finished my midterm. It went pretty well. It wasn't too bad, so hopefully I got a good grade, but I am headed out right now. I'm on campus.
I just got back to my apartment after a very long day out. I met up with my friend Lois and we metroed over to the Ceramics Cafe to meet up with our other friend Michelle. I think we were at the Ceramics Cafe for like four hours. So that was a lot of fun and a very good de-stressing activity after my midterm and all the studying that I've been doing. It was just nice to paint and just chat and catch up with them. So I'm really glad that I went. And then afterwards we left the Ceramics Cafe at like 9 p.m. and we hadn't eaten dinner at all. So we went to go find some food somewhere Somewhere. We would try to go to Yakata Yokobai for ramen, which is my favorite place, and they were full even though it was like 9 p.m. on a Wednesday, which is insane, and there was like a 45 minute wait. So we ended up going to Frite Alors, which is like this poutine place in the area, and we had poutine there, which was really good. I just got their signature Frite Alors poutine. That was delicious. I feel like I never get poutine unless it's at least after 9 p.m., and it's almost always after I go to the Ceramics Cafe. Last time I went to the Ceramics Cafe, I got La Banquise. This time I got Frite so maybe it's a tradition. morning it is thursday i just made myself a little bit of breakfast um i just did an egg scramble with chives and mushroom which i'm going to eat while i watch some youtube videos but today i just have my two classes but the first one is online so i can watch that from home which is why i'm still in my pajamas I just hopped off of my first class of the day, which was a Zoom call, because we had our guest speaker, which was the founder of Love Good Fats, which is a company that she grew from like zero to over a hundred million dollars in, I think the span of three years, which is insane. She was super knowledgeable and we got to ask her questions after. And I guess that's one of the good parts of being a Days Hotel student. But anyways, right now I am going to be chilling for the next hour and a half before I have to go to my class. So I'm just going I'm going to continue editing my blog. It is almost time for my marketing research class, so I have changed out of my pajamas. I'm wearing the new HKSN quarter zip that we just got. It is a little bit big, but I love it. It's so cute. It's like a little Vita lemon tea design, but it says HKSN and it's a quarter zip instead of a hoodie this year, which is very exciting. But now it is almost time for class, so let's head over to Brothman. <laughs> home now. I just picked up some strawberries and chicken from the grocery store on my way back. I'm gonna make myself a little bit of dinner. It is a little bit later. I just finished my workout with my friend Katie, which is why I am currently lying on my yoga mat, but I'm gonna shower now and then I'm gonna call my family because it is Amazing Race Night, which is when we watch the newest episode of The Amazing Race together. So I'm just going to end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure to give it a like and subscribe for more videos of my life here in Montreal as a student at Miguel University. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.